Hey guys, how is everyone doing today? Sorry that, um, you know, when I make videos on this laptop, it's a little bit loud. So I'll do my best to, you know, bring it down. But, um, hopefully you can understand me because, again, this mic kind of sucks. So, what I want to rant about today is, um, pretty soon, in about two weeks, I'm going to be testing for my private pilot li license. And what that means is, for the past couple of months, is I've been training to be able to fly planes. But not like, you know, Delta. That's later down the road. What I've been doing is, say, um, flying small planes. Like, if you don't know what I'm talking about, look up DA-20, Diamond-20, or a Cessna. And basically, they're just two-seater planes, and... Like I said, they're private planes. Just, just the pilot and you. So I was talking to some people that I know that travel a lot because some people go to anime, anime, and steampunk conventions and stuff like that. And I know people who are heavily into business and marketing and stuff like that. So, but um, I got the question or the doubt of how safe am I when I'm in the plane? the person that I was talking to was saying that I'm a novice because I have not been flying 30 plus years. Now I understand that but to sit there and uh, criticize when this person has not even seen me fly or seen what these planes can do or what I'm being tested on to be able to fly you know my question is if I if it wasn't safe or professional for me to fly would the FAA or even government even allow me to fly? The question is no. So if they think that I can be a pilot, what makes it so far off that I can be good enough to, you know, not crash? Yeah, there's some interested instances on the news about people crashing and you know, hitting the nose when they come in the land, but you know, those things happen throughout time. It's kind of like uh, a month ago where, you know, I'm driving along from work and, you know, I sneeze and I crash into a guy. You know, just stuff like that happens. So, I find this extremely ignorant because this person sat here and pretty much said, said that I don't know how to fly and I can't fly because I haven't been flying for a complete year and it really shocked me because this person is really smart and they usually do the research before they say something like that and so what I'm saying is yeah I know it's kind of a short time between point A and point B to where you can fly a private plane but your instructor has a sign off that you can fly and, th and then an instructor from the government and from the FAA has have to fly with you for your, trek for your uh, check ride and make sure that you can fly without you know doing anything bad because again it is a literal test and they ask you orally written and in the plane what you're supposed to be doing and what protocols you're supposed to be following so, overall, I mean, like, am I just, you know, just flipping out because I'm stupid? Or do I have just too big of an ego? Or, or am I in the right in saying that I'm almost a professional and doubting my abilities is a huge insult? I don't know. Part of me thinks I'm just having a big ego. But, um, even if you look up the safety for private planes it's pretty top notch it's just like any other plane the only difference is the altitude levels that you'll be traveling traveling at like for say delta those planes have to have to be pressurized because what the different air spaces they're tr flying up to 80,000 feet what I'm flying is way lower I'm flying around let's say 4,500 feet above the ground that's that's average height because if I keep on going any higher, the air's gonna get thinner, and you know you're gonna be 
it's going to be hard to breathe and your ears are going to pop and you're not going to be able to you know really function so private planes aren't pressurized so that's how that works but again tell me if I'm just overreacting thanks for watching and hopefully next week I can post a video of my solo flight so I'll be in the plane by myself flying alone and all I'm going to be doing is flying a little bit doing some touch and goes and then landing so hopefully I can get a video of that and thanks for watching oh, more will be up soon bye